I'm going to show you a super easy method of attaching a leader to a fly line with a nail knot using only a bodkin needle. I'm using this stealth bodkin needle because it has the perfect diameter and length. Begin with the end of the fly line and the bodkin needle in your left hand. Be sure the end of the fly line and the end of the bodkin needle are aligned at about the same length. Place the butt section of the leader next to the fly line with the fattest end of the leader facing toward the left. Now place the skinny end of the leader in your left hand facing to the right. Align the skinny end of the leader to be just a bit longer than everything else. At this point you should be holding a loop of leader in your left hand and you're ready to form the knot. Begin wrapping the right side of the loop toward the left hand. You will wrap it around everything the bodkin needle, the fly line, and both the fat and skinny ends of the leader that you're holding in your left hand. Wrap a minimum of four to five turns. The nail knot is a compression knot, and the more turns you do, the better it will hold. After making the turns, hold the wraps in place with the index finger of your left hand. Grab the skinny end of the leader with your right hand and pull it to the right. The large loop that was formed earlier will tighten and you will now have a nail knot formed around the bodkin needle. Hold the knot tightly with the left hand and remove the bodkin needle. It is very important that you do not let go of the nail knot with the left hand until the knot has been completely tightened. While holding the knot, use your right hand to tug gently on the skinny end and then the fat end. Continue with the gentle tugs back and forth while rolling the knot between the fingers of your left hand. This helps keep the knot clean and straight. You will feel the knot tighten between your fingers. Remove your grip on the knot and trim the tag ends. The nail knot can be intimidating, but with a little practice it can be easily mastered.